guys in this video we today we'll talk about uh, create a full factorial design and analyze a full factorial uh, factorial design using mini tab tools so let's get started in this section we were interested in determining the primer type and spray pressure that maximize paint adhesion by providing the best surface to study the the effects of the, these two factors on the adhesion of the paint we use a two level full factorial design in this activity we will work through the steps to create a, this design in minotab so we choose start then doe factorial and then create factorial design first we need to specify the type of the design in this experiment we are studying the effects of two factors primer type and spray pressure we want to evalu uh, evaluate two types of primer and two settings for spray pressure so we choose the two level factorial design a two factorial uh, and then uh, the number of factors is two Next, we click designs because we choose a two level factorial with only two factors our only design choice is a full factorial to obtain an estimate of pure error we replicate the design for this experiment we choose four from the number of replicates for corner points and then click ok now we click factors here we can we, we can assign names to our factors and their levels in the row for factor a we type pressure in name and numeric in type and we type 300 in low and 400 in high in the row for factor b we type primer type in name choose text from the type and we type a in low and b in high and then we click ok and then we click ok again to create a full factorial design ok so very easy right so in this activity we walk through the steps in minitab to create a full factorial design to determine how primer type and spray pressure affected paint adhesion we'll apply what we've learned using different data in the create a full factorial design exercise okay so now let's see how to use minotaps to analyze a full factorial design to study the effects of the two factorials and their interaction on the adhesion of the paint we employ a two level full factorial design in this activity we'll walk through the steps to analyze these designs in minotaps first we need to specify the column containing the observed measurements so we enter adhesion in responses next we click terms we need to specify the model we want to fit to study the the effects of both factors and their interaction we can accept the default model which includes the main effects for the primer type and pressure and the interaction term primer type by pressure then we click ok now we click graphs to create a visual display of the effect test we check Pareto we usually reduce the model by and uh, the model and eliminate non-significant terms before uh, verifying the model assumptions with residuals plots in this example however we already know that all terms are significant so no model reduction is necessary 
and we include this plot now. We check normal plot, residuals versus this, residuals versus order, and then click OK. OK, so that's all. So in this activity, we walk through the steps in Minotaur to analyze a full factorial design by fitting a model to the paint adhesion experiment data. We determine deep the main effects and the interaction effect of primer type and spray pressure were significant. We display the Pareto chart of effects to visualize our results and display residual plots to verify the model assumptions. Uh, we will apply what we learn using different data in the analyze a full factorial design exercise later. Thank you for your listening. Okay, so in the next step, we'll do the exercise by creating a full factorial design.